Hello everyone, in this second lecture we are going to cover important concepts such as what are the dimensions of quality, what is the role of various functions in the organization towards quality, what are the critical challenges for Indian organizations, what, what are the Indian organi organization recipient in terms of quality. So why uh, do we talk about quality so much? Quality is now an obsession in the contemporary world the entry ticket for doing business it's an order qualifying criteria the truth beauty and God so if you talk about quality if you talk about business everyone today is only bothered about the quality which you bring to the table so what are the advantages of superior quality now because we want superior performance and competitive advantage for customers relationships and delight to avoid decline in work ethics, for innovation in our products and services, for our personal and spiritual well-being, to increase our ability to manage change for energized committed workforce, to expand boundaries of business. So if you talk about the advantage of superior quality, these are the reasons. You want to build more relationship, you want to bring more business. And here, this, this chart which you can see, the stages and the phase of quality. Now you can see, once you are building the product, this is the time where you need to ensure maximum amount of time once you are making a product. Because as you go up during the process, the quality of system, business chain and quality of society, the degree of complexity increases so this is where you won't have much better scope for making changes in the quality so once you are coming up with a new technology at the production stage at the design building stage at the stage where the product is being manufactured this is the place where you need to spend more of the time and build a product which has least of the defects in has the maximum quality because once it starts getting into the system and reaches the society its complexity will increase so this is your area of opportunity this is where you can make the difference so what are various dimensions of quality so quality is not something which is uh, you know isolation it cannot be seen in isolation there are several dimensions of quality which includes features, performance, safety, customer service, appearance, durability and serviceability. So if you bring all these factors into your production, the quality of production will definitely improve. Some of the icons of quality in our country, Virat Kohli, Taj Mahal, Burj Khalifa, these are some of the buildings, play people who are known for the quality which they bring to the table. Now let's talk about the definition of quality and the concept. Now W. Edwards Deming defined quality. Good quality means a predictable degree of uniformity. So whenever you talk about good quality you know that there will be some sort of uniformity and dependability with a quality standard suited to its customer. Joseph M. Juran, it's fit for purpose, a quality process or product is fit for its purpose. If the purpose of an aircraft is to be fast, efficient, comfortable and safe, then that's the definition of quality aircraft. Philip B. Crosby, Conformance to Requirements, Notable Book, Quality is Free, 1979, Working from Requirements, it's easy to validate conformance and identify non confirmance The problem with this definition is that requirements may offer a biased and subjective view of quality. In many cases, requirements represent little more than the ideas of business stakeholders. There is often no objective validation that these ideas will yield quality results. Karao Ishiwaka, to practice quality control is to develop, design, produce and service a quality product which is most economical, most useful and always satisfactory to the consumer. As per Armin V. Fregbum, 
Total Quality Control is an effective system for integrating the quality development, quality maintenance and quality improvement efforts of various kinds in an organization. Now hidden plant is so much extra work is performed in correcting mistakes. Accountability for quality because quality is everybody's job. It's it may become nobody's job. So you need to ensure that people are there to ensure quality, especially at the production stage, the concept stage. So the concept of quality cost. Now Genchi Taguchi said deviation from target is a loss. Quality loss has the loss imparted to the society from the time the product is shipped and this related the loss to the society as a whole. So once the product is shipped, it is maintained, we need to ensure best of the quality. If there is a quality loss, this will be a loss to the whole society. And that is why it is emphasized more and more that during the production stage, during the designing stage, when the product is being thought of to be built, this is the time where we need to focus more on quality. It included both company costs such as reworking, scrapping and maintenance and any loss to the customer through poor product performance and lower reliability. Now American society of quality denotes an excellence in goods and services especially to the degree they confirm to the requirements and satisfy customers. Now quality does not come from the certifications, ISO certifications. Because these standards are not designed to create quality. These standards are there to measure quality. It's a bookshelf to store and manage your quality creation process. So once you have an effective quality only then you can ensure to bring these certifications or these standards. So the effect of quality are experienced by the customers. Product quality perception comes from your design specification and the manufacturer standards achieved. Service quality perception comes from your service process design and standard of delivery. Now quality is the degree to which performance meets expectations. This is so important. Once you are meeting the expectations through the performance, you are ensuring quality. So once you bring a product in the market, people have lot of expectations. And if you are able to fulfill that expectation through your performance through your product that means you have ensured the quality as simple as that now what are the three key elements of quality quality of design the product needs to be designed to satisfy customer needs quality of confirmance closeness with which the finished product or supplied service matches the specification of the original design Quality of reliability, the ability of the finished product to provide trouble-free performance in the field over an acceptable period of time. So quality improvement for customer value. Now quality of performance for customer and product, quality of confirmance, design and product, quality of design, customers and design. So the, pus the purpose is to give value to the customer. So apply quality improvement. Quality improvement is an ongoing process and the implementation of quality principles is not limited to industry. These principles are for all businesses, offices, services, education, healthcare and other organization. Quality may be viewed as an object of interest, an end state to guide human behavior, a normative standard to correct human actions, a discriminating mechanism to judge what matters from what does not matter. A cause which furthers survival of the human system and associated life support system. Now two flavors of quality, potential quality and actual quality. Potential quality is the known maximum possible value added up per unit of input. Actual quality is the current value added per unit of input. Now quality a multi-perspective dimension, business perspective focuses on why, where and to what extent the organization must invest in or exploit quality, which strategies, products and services, alliances, acquisitions or disinvestments should be considered from knowledge related points of view. Management perspective focuses on determining, organizing, directing and monitoring quality related activities required to achieve the desired business strategies and objectives. Hands on operational perspective focuses on applying the quality tools expertise to operating systems. Now quality management facilitator 
pursuit of quality is an ongoing journey through quality management facilitator operations marketing external specialist research and development and engineering now let's talk about business functions and responsibility for quality top management top level support and encouragement of quality effort quality control quality assurance plus promotion coordination and effect and control of entire quality effort accounting research sales and marketing design engineering tool engineering product engineering purchasing manufacturing so pursuit of quality the linkages are perceived value customer satisfaction and customer loyalty the world competitors report establishes that competitiveness is equal to competitive assets into competitive process and this is competitive asset in competitive process so once you multiply these two things you will get the competitiveness index so what are the crucial challenges for indian organization use statistical science in a teamwork environment to front actual problems make product engineering or design engineering responsible for produce quality until production yields have reached optimum level discontinue the wasteful use of spc and free people using resources to focus on real problem discontinue methods focus solely on training and instead make the problem solving the center of attention require a checklist of top management review and enables those with profit and loss responsibility to correct evaluate the effectiveness of produce quality improvements indian organization recipient of demeaning deming award and malcolm bridge award now what are the critical dimensions of quality how do you evaluate the importance of such dimensions for a typical healthcare industry how society gets benefited from quality what are the similarities and differences in various functions of quality how do you evaluate them for manufacturing and service industry how organizations can improve their competitiveness by winning quality award certifications so conclusion is quality is a multidimensional perspective quality helps the organization to expand their boundaries and be competitive in global market everyone must continue uh in the organization must commit for the quality indian organization need to be critical for the adoption of quality initiatives in six sigma thank you